This is a series of videos. Please refer to methods of stitches, ignoring the yarn color. Select the corresponding yarn colors in your material package to learn. Please refer to both the videos and the instructional brochure during your crocheting process. Please make sure to first view the beginning 10 instructional videos to learn the basic methods of crocheting, and then view the instructional videos for your purchased product. Little Hamster Beginners are advised to watch the basic teaching videos first and do some practice with a practice yarn in the kit. The body of the hamster will demonstrate with yellow yarn. Please refer to the stitches, ignoring yarn's corner. Working into a magic ring. Wrap the yarn around your fingers like this. Pinch the yarn tail with your thumb and the middle finger. In round one, start with one chain stitch. Then work six single crochets. Insert hook into the loop on your middle finger. Yarn round hook and pull the yarn through the loop. A magic ring is formed. Yarn round hook and pull the yarn through the loop on the hook. That's one chain stitch. Next, work six single crochets. Insert hook into the magic ring. Hook the yarn and pull up loop through the ring. There are two loops on the hook. Yarn on the hook, pull the yarn through both loops on the hook. That's one single crochet. Place a marker in the first stitch. Such a V shape on the side stands for one stitch. Okay. Continue to work five more single crochets. Then remove the loop from finger. We can count the ways to check the number of stitches. Okay, six single crochets in total. Pull the yarn tail tight to close the ring. Pull the yarn tail on the back. Work one slip stitch in the first stitch to join this round. Insert hook into the first stitch. Throw the underneath of the V. Okay. Hook the yarn and pull up one loop through the stitch. Then pull the first loop through the original loop on the hook. That's one slip stitch. Attention! The chain stitch in the beginning and the slip stitch at the end of each round won't be counted into the number of stitches. Okay, remove the marker. In round 2, start with one chain stitch, then work 6 increases. Work one chain stitch first. Then work 6 increases. Increase means working two single crochets in the same stitch. First, we work one single crochet in this market stitch. One single crochet is done. Place a marker in the first stitch.
then work one more single crochet in the same stitch. Okay, this is one increase. Continue to work five more increases. Work two single crochets in each stitch. Six increases are done. Work one slip stitch in the first stitch. Insert hook into the first stitch, hook the yarn, and pull the yarn not only through the stitch, but also through the original loop on the hook. Okay, that's one slip stitch. Round two is done. In round three, start with one chain stitch. Then work set of one single crochet, one increase for six times. Work one chain stitch first. Next, work one single crochet. Place a marker in the first stitch. Then work one increase, which means working two single crochets in the same stitch. Okay. One set is done. Keep working five more sets. We work one single crochet and one increase as one set. Work one slip stitch in the first stitch to join this round. Round three is done. 